him if you will, but what is the idea though? video in different parts of this area. Of course there's a little bit of the trial and palace area. Oaks building there. Yeah. Yeah, oh wow, that thing's actually got water spraying. It's delicious. Oh, it's delicious. Bernie the bear. <laughs> I'll look in oh, Craven. <laughs> and then of course, good old cub house with the public with the public restrooms that I've used twice. <laughs> Side of that place, not in the restroom part, but in, but in somewhere in that middle. Do we have video? But then, of course, the gas station I've been to twice in the convenience store, and then there's the water. Spray in the air from the shore. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a flipping day, but the Shriner Auditorium. <laughs> They're hoping to save that building, They'll not tear it down to make a hotel, but, you know, uh, of course, who knows what will happen down, down the road. We really get a video of the water, though, at least this is a good one. It's very nice. Now to the horse. Yeah, I mean, I probably have. I don't know, maybe a few videos in this area. I don't really know. Shoot all kinds of videos. I should go back and watch the very first one that I made when we, before we lived here. I mean, they're supposed to. <laughs> yeah, 
video may not see the light of day if I get a hit. I mean, looked at the real estate in a while, I'm not sure, but I know before when I had looked at some of them, they were, yeah, pretty good amount. And six figures of price. Let's get trash. Well, yeah, but ours is Thursday. Their trash day is Monday. Yeah, yeah because we're near the edge of the Thursday trash day. We're also at the edge of the Monday trash day. Alright, but ours is Thursday. Oh, we're right. trash. Right. trash there. And there's another trash day near us, too. Friday is the trash day that hardly anyone has. Friday is like the area going toward Bridgeton. And oh, the Salvation the, And I think a few other little areas toward the outskirts of town. But I've never been in their family store. I have not either. I've not been in there. I'm hoping I'm not heading towards the like, really bad area. Uh, this area's not too far from the water. Yeah, I don't think I have any video up this way. Though. I don't think. Nah, this is heading toward where the city bus runs. Well, the city bus runs like over there, but it's close to it. It just follows kind of near the water for a while, but you can't get lost. I mean, eventually you would be heading toward, going back toward where we live, but, but it doesn't go all the way through. I mean, you'll eventually wind up on some other road, but, but I'm pretty sure I don't have video back here. I can do this thing, so. so this might be a good opportunity to get some video back this way, but it is a lot of grass back here. There's not really much back here or in there. There's some houses though once you go past this area. So is that the flood area? Is that why that's blocked off? Uh, I think there used to be something there, but they tore it down. Like a big factory or something? Yeah, I'm not sure. There was a factory somewhere around here, so maybe. But I think there were also petroleum around here somewhere too. So there may have been like those big petroleum circular cylinder type of thing, whatever those things. Because I think they used to have them along the riverfront, but they got rid of those years ago. From what I understand. That might have been a lot of that empty grass now. Because I don't think it was this far up, so that was probably back there. This might have been something else. Well, no, actually, the factory was that building there. Well, never mind. The factory was way back here. So, yeah, that probably was all the gas stuff, because this was the factory here for the, uh, for the Mayola milk, I think, or but it looks like they've done some stuff, but, well, it's now, oh, Mayola at Riverside, it's an event center now, so they actually saved the building for an event center, but yeah, that used to be the old Mayola plant, they're somewhere else now, but, yeah, I knew it was up here somewhere, but I sure exactly where near the water but yeah there's a lot of history in that place yeah, that's now an event center for sale why don't you get right on the water if you want that property and yeah. build a neat little house there. I think a lot of people are concerned about flooding yeah. I mean build it up like this I mean way. these people put yeah they built up yeah. it's where the only thing I have to worry about is their vehicle <laughs> I have not, definitely not been back here, so I don't know about all these holes. But this is actually the end of it here, where we start heading back toward that other road. I mean, you have to turn left and start. You have to turn left and start heading back toward the other road. So if you went straight, where would you go? Well, you can't. It doesn't go through. Well, I mean, if, if you went straight, where was that? Well, I see water. Right it goes. Now. It goes by the water, you know. There's stops on here, though. Yeah, I mean, you gotta go this way. It comes out. Well, cemetery's right there. So, so I mean, we're just about back to the area. Okay. Like, uh, 
we'll get some of the grays on the video at least. But this is the road here at National that goes back toward Glen Burnie. Which, which way? To the right. But we're at the National Cemetery, so we're here. So, soldiers? Yeah. Well, that's where New Bern Cemetery is for the veterans. Well, that have wound up living in New Bern the later part of their lives. Yeah. All that connects back to the new surfer. Like, you can't go, these are all dead ends up in there. Like, so it's not like you can really go. But, but yeah, at this point, it's Oaks Road, and this heads back to Glen Burnie. Eventually. The houses lead toward the river, though, on some of these roads, but they don't go very far. As all that goes toward the water, clerk, and all that. school there at the top of Simmons. Okay, there's a school that we usually turn to. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it goes back toward Piggly Wiggly and Dunkin' Donuts and all that. Uh, that's how far out we are. Is school not open? Uh, there's vehicles over there, yeah. Okay. School's open. open. Yeah. No, but there's also a church over there, too, so that could have been possibly the church there. Maybe, okay, because there's a church and a school okay, yeah, over there, but I think that was probably the other parts of school, the school buses, and I guess there's a teacher if you do. Looks like a swampy area. Yeah, this part is near the river. There really isn't much here. Because it's that creek that goes into the river. Yeah. Yeah, this part can flood and some. Yeah, this looks like a flooding area. Like, here. Sure. At least a few. <laughs> oh wow, there's a tent here. This is a church. Though. Probably. I guess. I couldn't really read what was on the marquee, so I'm not sure. But probably. But we're almost back to Glen Burnie already. Because that flashing red light is Glen Burnie. TV stations now too. That's our office. North of Furniture Fair, north of Burger King and Wendy's. Almost oh, to the Hatteras business, but. Five points, mini mark. Okay. Yeah, because that's the Hatteras business over there. So where's that park? Oh, that's a little bit further down. We've been in there, though. But it's on this road, right? Yeah. I don't remember how to go in it, but it's... We've been in it, though. But they've done more since we were in it. Because they had, like, a big grand opening about a month ago. We were in much more before that, but... I don't remember how to get into it, though. Because the sign, like, comes up all of a sudden. But it's probably the next turn on the right, but... Uh, oh yeah, yeah. See, there is a sign. It says Mark Marietta Park, but uh, but it's like right there. And back in there. But, yeah. I mean, really, I don't know if you can see it too well coming the other way, but it's right after the maintenance garage. They're coming from. There we live. 